Hey, it's Laura Levitt from EnergyHealerAndSuccessCoach.com and one of the biggest reasons that create anxiety and distress in our lives and persistent illness in the body is that we're not really bringing our presence and our energy and our, our attention into our physical body. Most of us live in our head in a constant spin of fears and delusions and beliefs and everything that we've adopted in our life. And we're sort of escaping actually experiencing our pain. We escape the experience of our fear. We, ex we escape the experience of the lack and limitation. And, and that's what creates and allows the disease to take over our bodies. So no matter what you do, get the best supplements, the best doctor, the best guru, the best healers or whatever. If you're not willing to be present in your body and really allow your body to release these energies, you're going to keep living that same toxic experience, whether it's in your health, your relationships, your money, or overworking, or whatever it might be. The surest and fastest way to reverse that is to actually go towards your fears. Now, nobody wants to feel fear. They don't want to feel all their pain. But when we live in unconsciousness, we are constantly reacting to it anyway. It's still there. What would it take for me to be willing to feel my pain, to experience it, to, to breathe through it and release it so that it's no longer running me, that, that energy? You know, what it really takes is to breathe deeply, to practice that over and over, day after day, to really embody more presence, to you really develop a more power beyond anything you've known before because the power is in your body, breathing feeling it, accepting, honoring it. It's the most powerful way to really change your health. That way you can really um, feel what you're feeling in the moment. Eat and enjoy and have your body process like it's supposed to physically. And you can do things that, that you love that make you feel good, like meditation, like yoga, like um, going for a walk and enjoying the beauty outside. When you really enjoy this, be present to it and feel this energy in your body, it's the fastest way to move through all the issues in your life. Okay, take three deep breaths into your body and just release the, the struggle. Release and let that go. Sometimes when we're tuning into this fear, it, you think it's going to be um, turning up the volume, making it worse, but it doesn't. Okay, it doesn't. You are going to honor what is in the moment. You can use a lot of tools like tapping to an energy healing tools to really help release some of the issues around that. But really not struggling against it is the key here because what we resist persists, right? So just breathe and accept and do what you can in the moment to just be with it. And it allows it to, um, to shift and change before your very eyes really. This is what's happening because we are not going to be holding it so tight. Okay, so this is one good tip and keep watching my videos because two of my favorite tools in helping people to really connect in a deeper way and release the things that are issues in their lives is tapping and emotional emotion code and body code. Those are my favorite techniques. So if you want to learn more, Stay tuned. This is Laura Levitt at energyhealerandsuccesscoach.com.